Aloha. Ring's Great Adventure has landed in Hawaii. We've teamed up with Kristen and Sam, and together we're going to explore one of the most beautiful islands in the world, Oahu. Just pulled into Island Vintage Coffee to start the day. Joe! If there's one thing that me and Virginia like, it's markets. There's tiny little shops everywhere, right snuggled into the centre of Hawaii. It's the coolest. Just hold, just hold, you gotta hold it there. You gotta hold it there, keep it there. Oh, he's coming up. Nah. Yeah, keep doing it, keep doing it. Okay, so we're cruising down the street and we've hit the beach. It is insane, I can't wait to see what's next. Hey man. How you doing? Oh, bloody knackered. It's hot. Where the heck are you from? Australia, man. Oh, dude, the Outback? Yeah, absolutely. Wow. I've got a YouTube channel, man. I was wondering if I could ask you a couple of questions about the place. I'll yeah. try to ask, answer them as yeah, much right. as I can. Cool. Well, let's find out some information, hey? Hawaii. So I've only been here for two days. Oh, wow. I've been here uh, about four weeks, five weeks now. And uh, hi, my name is Ernest Champagne. and. I just met this guy, you see he's from the awesome Outback, and it's a place I gotta check out one time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so my name's Brendan. I'm from my channel's name's Rings Great Adventure. Rings Great Adventure. Yeah, that's it man. Oh wow. And so what we do is we do travel and adventure and all that kind of stuff and and we like we just we we, we landed here two days ago. Alright. So it's the first time we've ever been to Hawaii. What can you tell us man? What do you think what well, first off, what do you think about the people? Oh, the local Hawaiians? Oh, they're fantastic. Yep. They're, they're loving people. You just, you got to love the culture. You have to love the culture and they love you. You know yep. what I mean? And uh, again, you got the surfers and stuff like that. I got to surf a little bit while I was out here. But I mean, there's the luau's I haven't been to, but I mean, I heard they're great. It's a great thing to check out while you're here. Nice. Uh, what, is there any tourists that you don't like? Uh, the racist ones, you know, the ones that are all meat heady and stuff like that, ones that aren't very friendly, but, you know, you gotta turn your cheek at them like the good book says. Yeah, yeah, good on you, man. How good's that? What a great attitude to have. How, so how long have you been here in Hawaii? About four weeks, four or five weeks. Now, I actually came here from the mainland, from Washington, D.C., to feed the homeless, and uh, I've been able to do that. And I'm homeless myself, so, you know, I panhandle and I, and I, and I give back to the homeless and stuff, so. How good's that? Uh, it's good. That's a that's a pretty bloody that's a pretty gallant thing to do. Yeah, well, you know, you take your own time out to go and help other people. Oh yeah, it's uh, it's a good thing to do for the Lord. I I asked him. I said, "You get me to Hawaii, and I shall feed the homeless." And he brought me here. So. Well, I better stay friends with him. He's got the good Lord watching over him. Amen. As do we all. Yeah. So, what, are you looking at staying here for a little bit longer, man? What's the, what's the deal? Oh, uh, I'm not sure. You know, I came here and you know I got beat up and my stuff stolen from me, so I'm just oh. waiting for my family to. You're send me joking. Some stuff. I wish I was. That's a bit rough. Uh, but other than that, um, the thing is, is you know, I, I want to go. I would like to see the Pope actually perform a real exorcism. But you know, I'd love to go. Oh, to how space. good would that be? Have you right. seen all the movies? Yeah, I don't believe in the power of credit. They said you can banish a demon in the name of Yahushua HaMashiach. Just like that. Oh, yeah. Just like that. Yeah, Malachim Chaim. He's the king of kings and the lord of lords. Yeah. So you got yourself a pair of sunnies? You see, I've got some sick sunnies. Oh, no. Those look like some snowboarding ones. Where's your sunnies, man? They didn't get pinched, did they? Oh, no. I didn't bring any with me. You didn't bring any in Hawaii? I can't cover these gorgeous things. Oh, he does have nice eyes, doesn't he? A bit like myself, we both got blue eyes. Hey, right? <laughs> they say people with blue eyes can see the most. So my sonnies, 
as soon as you got all your stuff pinched, I'll oh. give you a brand new set of Savage Sunnies. What do you reckon about that, brother? Dude, that looks so cool. So how good's that? Thank you, sir. Ernest? Brennan? It was pleased to meet you. You too, sir. Good luck in Hawaii, and wish me luck, man, because I reckon I'm going to need it. Wish you luck. Hey, hope to see you out there on the Autobahn sometime, yeah? Yeah, yeah me too, man. <laughs> <laughs> it was cool to meet you, brother. Yeah, it's sick. Ernest, what a legend. Brennan, even better. <laughs> <laughs> Here at the new Nupoli lookout, it's we gonna are. suss this out. Apparently, it was where the king brought all of. I think they said it was the last king, wasn't it? King Kamehameha? Yeah, the last king before the Americans took over. Oh, oh. I don't know about that, but yeah. supposedly it was the last king and he had the massive battle here and it united all the islands. And yeah, he led them in a charge to war. To glory. And glory and war. He was like, I'm American. <laughs> so we're going to go and check out the lookout. One thing about Hawaii is there's heaps of roosters. They're everywhere. And as always, thanks very much for watching. We really appreciate your support. If you've enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And we'll see you next time on Ring's Great Adventure. Jee-hoo! Jee